Welcome back, this is Yamish Yak. Today we got Gunslinger Elysium Suicidal. What? What? It's the Christmas update! It's here. I have no idea what the- I haven't been paying attention at all to the update cycle. Um, so I have no idea what, uh, what- I, I don't know what the events are, I don't know what guns we've got, I don't know anything about what's going on here. Uh, so I'll have to look into that maybe soonish so we can get the events done and check out some of the new content and, and stuff, but uh, this is an interesting looking map anyway. It's very grandiose. I don't really see the... It, it, it seems like a very easy map to me. Like, I guess we'll say all, any map that has very large open spaces like this tends to be pretty uh, straightforward, especially if you have Lots of cover kind of littered throughout as well. You know, it's, it's still very open, but there's, there's, you know, bits and bobs and pieces and stuff kind of strewn about the landscape here, kind of protecting you from husks, edars, matriarch, um, in multiplayer, hell on earth kind of stuff, maybe, you know, patriarch, hans. Um, but, uh, you know, you don't really need stuff to fight the, uh, Matriarch, really, but I also did not restart my computer. I don't know if we have a audio delay or whatever. Nobody's ever complained about it before, but I notice it on occasion when I live, when I watch my videos. Let's set up this uh, this thing here. I wanna I wanna check out what's going on up here. We cannot. I bet the boss comes down there. I bet the boss comes crashing down from from up top or something. What? <laughs> it's a it's a holdout style map. <laughs> no way. I'm like, man, this map's just gonna be like kind of pathetically easy, and then <laughs> expectations subverted heavily. Heavily subverted. Little presence runner. I haven't. Uh, I haven't played. I don't think I've ever played a game during Christmas that has events. I think that this is the first time in my life that I've played a Christmas event in a game at Christmas time. You know? I've, I've played Christmas events in games when they, uh, you know, end up launching, uh, just all the events are live at all the time now because we're giving up on the game and not going to be maintaining it anymore. Or, you know, changing the, uh... Uh, time on my system or whatever to, to get it, but this is the first time that I am experiencing a game that has events during Christmas. I think I've had, uh, I think I've experienced Halloween before. I've definitely experienced Easter. I, I don't think that I've ever experienced a Christmas event live though. So this is, this is my first experience with that, which is kind of cool, I guess. I have never, uh, played the Christmas event in... KF2 before, like any version of KF2, or any version of Killing Floor rather. Uh, so this is the first time seeing the Christmas Zeds. I know that a lot of people see it as repetitive because it never changes, and I'm sure these are the same as it was last year, but I think they look nice, I guess. Little presents running around. It's okay. I love the siren. The siren looks awesome. Stalkers are a little bit Meh. I like the uh, the cookie clots. You know, they look good. Um, where do you, where do you want me to go here? Are we just getting teleported to the? Ooh! Oh, so it, like okay, so we're gonna go somewhere else, and then it's gonna bring stuff. Oh, that's so cool! Oh, that is so cool! All right, all right. So where do we end up going to this time? Because we're gonna we're gonna end up going somewhere else. And it's gonna have a theme, right? And then that that the you know, aspects of that theme are gonna be brought back. That's really really cool. I really like that. This map is awesome. We have to look at what the uh, we'll be playing on this map a lot. Uh, we're gonna have to look at what the maybe we play on this one and then go to a different one for a boss fight maybe or something. I don't know. I do not know. Um, we're gonna have to play on this map a fair bit. I know that we'll have to. I mean, I don't know. Um, it's all the same, really, these events, uh, these days. So we'll probably have a, uh, like, Reach Wave 15. 
uh, kill a boss on uh, this map on like a weekly or whatever. Um, probably like a kill number of Zeds. Actually, no, we can probably check it just here, right? Collect four tomes in Elysium. Collect three roses. Botanica Arena. Elysium's Lore Master Sanctum Arena. And Wave 15 on Endless. Maybe we'll do that next time. Now that's bullet time. That should maybe get us the opportunity to do the uh, tomes and all that. If I can figure out what the heck those are. What the heck are those? I wonder. I think they're in like uh, one of those other maps. We might have been able to find like a... Uh... This is a really cool map actually. It's a really cool map. I like it. I like it a lot. Yeah, we'll do we'll do Endless next time. This time we're going to try and figure out if we can see what the heck that Lore Master and Tomes and stuff are all about, you know? So that we can get that done in the Endless match. Uh, that should hopefully get us the different arenas as well. Hopefully. Oh, this is a really cool map, though. This is a really cool map. We'll check out the um, DLC weapons as well. Uh, I think this time... Like I said, I haven't really been staying up to date on it, so I don't really know. But I think we got just a, uh, a Berserker weapon this time. Scrake. I love the Scrake. It's a cute Scrake. I think we just got a Berserker weapon, like some kind of cold shotgun axe or something. Um, I wonder if we got any HRG weapons. Let's take a quick peek. Not seeing anything. Not seeing anything. Nothing. 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 Um... Sharpshooter, maybe? No. SWAT? Where's the HRG weapon, you think? We got the arc generator last time. I don't know. Perhaps we did not get a new... Uh... Is it here? Am I... Maybe, maybe we didn't get a new HRG weapon. Or maybe we did, and I'm just not seeing it. I can, I can see it going either way. So we'll probably go somewhere else on this wave. Be brought back on the next one for the boss fight, is my guess? Yes. Okay, cool. My goodness, this is weird. Uh, I would expect that this place would have the tomes, so let's maybe poke around. It's probably something you have to shoot, is my guess. This is weird, dude. This is weird. Collateral. Okay, we can get all the collectibles too, I guess, maybe. We'll do that in the endless match. Kind of poke around. See if we can't find them. I would I would expect the tomes would be in this one though, right? Because we got all this like library stuff and destruction and if I were a tome, I'd probably be chilling out in this uh, in this zone. This might be the lore master arena. It might be one of the arenas that we had to complete. Could be. Could be. I don't know, man. We'll, we'll definitely complete it. I have, I have no doubt that we'll, like, win. <laughs> so. I don't know, man. I don't know. Anyway. Um, really, really cool map. It's, it's, it's bizarre, but uh, very, very cool. Get out of here, dude. Get out of here. We haven't been up here. Let's go, let's go see what's going on up on this uh, ridge, perhaps. Can you, like, see something from here, maybe? I don't know. I don't know, man. Maybe there's something on the, the back side over here. You think? No? Pop a nade back there for these guys. How do you like them apples, huh? Okay, so I think there's just the one. We'll have to get the collectibles on the um, on the endless, which we will do in the next episode. Um, yeah, anyway, cool map. Nothing really else to, to say there right now, I guess. Uh, really, really cool map. I really like this map, though. Uh, anyway, I was playing Beat Saber earlier. 
I want to go check out what's over there too. I was playing Beat Saber earlier and uh, I bought the Lincoln Park set. I bought the Lincoln Park pack for the uh, for the game. Beat Saber it was. And uh, I played a bit of that. I'm not I'm not the biggest fan of Lincoln Park. I know that they're like a you know, kind of like a, a classic kind. Not not classic, but I don't know. I don't know what the right word for it is, but a very yeah, because it's not like you know, Beethoven or something. But um, we'll probably get teleported back here. Is my guess. It's not Beethoven or anything, but it, it's 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 kind of a similar kind of thing, right? Where it's so yeah, we get these these big balls brought up now. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Cool. I could do with some ammo. Have you checked your ammo? Um didn't think so. But there I know I know that they're a very popular band. Um in in kinda like a, a classics kinda way, right? Where where you you're like, yeah, they're great, you know. I love them. Kinda I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, but but they're they're um Everything is so simple. Popular, I guess, right? People, people like them. I, I'm not ever. I'm never really a big fan of them. I don't not like them. I, I, I bought the Lincoln Park pack on uh, on Beat Saber. I'm clearly not, you know, anti Lincoln Park, but I'm not. I'm not necessarily the biggest fan of their music. I never have been. People are always like, "Oh, Lincoln Park, let's go, dude!" You know, when it comes on the radio or something. But uh, I never really got behind it so much. Where are you going? You're over here? Right there. I never really got behind it so much. I don't know where you're going. I'm not gonna be able to, I'm not gonna be able to do it. I tell you what I am gonna be able to do though. And it's this right here. I don't like your direct approach because it scares me. Um But anyway. Some of those songs are, are pretty, you know. What? Did he just teleport over somewhere? What? I see him, but... What? <laughs> so some of their some of their songs are, are bangers, right? Like they're they're excellent songs. I'm, I'm sure I don't have to necessarily explain that, but uh, please, please die. Thank you. But uh, so I, I bought their songs and I loaded up what I've become. I think maybe. I'm feeling generous. I think that's what it was called. Anyway, the the moral of the story here is, holy hell, <laughs> the Lincoln Park songs on Beat Saber. Are insanely tough. I played like I, I can do an hour, hour and a half of Beat Saber like constant on on expert with like the Monster Cat tracks or the Rocket League tracks, Green Day, the original tracks. Like I can I can do it. I can last. I can play the game on expert any track pretty much. Uh, and I'll I'll be hold up. I'll be I'll be pretty okay, right? I played one track of the Linkin Park stuff and I was just like exhausted. <laughs> just the amount of movement that is involved in those tracks cuz they're like everywhere and they have the boxes rushing at you and so you want to get uh I don't know what these tomes are or what these roses are. Um also my shirt's inside out, so I'm going to just change that right quick. I'm going to just put my shirt on the right way in here real quickly because it's kind of bothering me okay there we go shirts on the right way yeah, I don't know what the roses or the tomes are anyway it was, it was just so much stuff and like they really liked the double and triple stuff with the with the blocks that are coming at you and it was it was it was it was, it was a lot of notes to hit <laughs> it was it, yeah, it, if, you, if you guys have Beat Saber and you don't have the Linkin Park tracks and you're and you're using it for for some kind of uh, exercise regime, as as am I, uh, get get the Linkin Park pack. 
It's, uh... <laughs> I, I was able to complete it. You know, first first try on... on uh, I only did two tracks, and, and I was like... Yeah, okay. <laughs> We're done. I had been in it for like, I don't know, 45 minutes, an hour, or something like that at that point, too, but... I, uh, I only did like two tracks, and I was like, yeah, no. I'm tired. I didn't get a great sleep last night, and I done, you know... About, about an hour-ish, a little bit less of uh, the workout prior to that, and then the, the intense, like, burst of the, the Linkin Park tracks there. And, uh, I was doing it on an expert, I, I play anything on an expert. I, don't, I, I can't move up to expert plus yet, but I'm close, I think. Um, and it, it was just incredibly <laughs> tough to, to, to do. I don't, I don't see more of the collectibles, honestly. Like, I'm looking around this arena as we play. I, I really just... Okay, whatever. I guess we're doing it this way then, hey? That's okay. Sometimes sometimes you do it this way. It does, it does get us completely full on ammo, which is, is a nice touch, for sure. I don't know where <laughs> the other orbs are. There's one. Um... Like a bloody Dickens novel out here. Is this the botanical garden? I'd, I'd be surprised. This is probably more like the nuclear garden. Let's see if we can't find any of those. Uh... We're only playing four rounds. That only gives us three different areas. I don't know if we're going to be able to find all of the uh, collectibles in, in just these areas. Maybe it's designed such that uh, that you can. Maybe it is. I see another one over here. You know, perhaps uh, the extra areas have enough. You know, the, the, any three areas, or I guess any two areas plus the the spawn area is is enough to finish it. Maybe just just so that when you're playing on the lowest rat rat um. So that's like some weird thing there. I don't want to know, man. It's weird. Um, I don't like this zone. To be honest with you, this this zone is. It does not get the, the seal of approval from, from me. Definitely does not. You want to leave one alive and then search. Okay? Is is kinda what I'm I'm at at this point. And then uh, and we wanna start maybe picking one to leave alive too. So there's only twenty one I wouldn't mind leaving a rioter alive. Wouldn't necessarily be bad. And Edar is definitely not the one to leave alive. That's definitely a bad choice of uh, Final Z when you're doing a collectible search. I don't know. Do we want to do a collectible search on this one, or would we rather do it? I mean, it, it, it just makes more sense to do it when we're doing the endless round, really, right? Like, it really does. Just make more sense. Can I get up there? I did see the, uh, the collectible there. We're going to get it with just a little bit of that right there. I didn't get it with the grenade. Brusky. I saw it. I saw it. Hello. <laughs> There's a lot of... Um, it's, it's a cool map. I don't necessarily think we'll be playing on it too much. It's a frustrating map. Um... I don't like maps that put you in these like super low visibility situations. Uh, this map has a lot of collision issues as well. Like I'm oftentimes getting stuck on what the like just this. Why can't I move here? Like I j I don't know. I know that I'm walking around in like like I'm just stuck on stuff all the time. Yeah, like I'm just getting stuck on stuff, and it's 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 super frustrating. So we probably won't be playing on this map too much. Are we still going? What? Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. Uh, so we probably won't be playing on this map too much after we finish up all the stuff on it. It's a really, really cool map. There there are just the low vis on, on this, and then I'm sure other ones are going to have low vis as well. I mean, one of them's pretty dark. Uh, and then, like, it's not just this map, but, like, all of the ones that we've been in, I've, I've been experiencing some pretty bad collision stuff. Um... Yeah, kind of, kind of stinks, but 
is what it is, right? Is what it is. Anyway, uh, that's gonna do it for today. I guess we'll check out the um, Zed kills here if you want that. Um, but that's gonna do it for today. So thanks for watching. Remember to like the video if you like, and subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say, and I'll see you next time when we do. I guess I have to do endless. I'm gonna have to go back out. Yeah. Bye.